ship was just going to pull up next to the tower. You don't quite believe that until it happens. But it is. It's locked right next to our hotel. All we have to do is walk through the building. We are, we'll be able to check into the ship. part of the ship while they're here. Upstairs in the dining room, she has um, obviously backed in. That must have been a big The bow here, the navigation's up there. So we've been staying here at the Hilton in Auckland. And we knew it was close, but we had no idea that you would just, you know, pop out the door here. And here would be the ship. Barb and Don join us around noon. We're gonna get a late checkout. We're gonna go walk around, get some water, that type of thing. So, really cool. So next time. Hi, um, it's a little later than my last little bit, but we were at the bow of the ship, and now we're at the stern of the ship. So here again is the Celebrity Fulton. These are the pet at the end. We met some folks that are doing a 52-day cruise, and they are starting in a balcony cabin on the concierge level then they are moving after the first 12 days and trying a cabin at the end. So this is what these cabins look like when you're off the end of the ship. So we're headed to go get some water but we've walked to the end of the, you know, one end to the other of the cruise ship, kind of scoped out what we need to do to get on and all that. Okay? And this is their high security levels to keep you away from the cruise ship. Boy, a little bit different than the US of A.